Hey guys, and welcome to my Mr. Perfect run of Plugman stage of Mega Man 9. Uh, just a pre-warning, about maybe just under a quarter of the way through this video, the audio starts to lag a bit, which uh, might get a bit annoying for some of you, but oh well. Um, what I recommend doing for this first room is just using the dual satellite, because every enemy in this room is, can be killed with the dual satellite, so all you have to focus on is the platforming, which in this room really isn't that difficult. Um, with this room, <laughs> really easy, just patience. Uh, a lot of this um, this uh, level is about being patient and just waiting for certain things to happen. Um, with this area, what I recommend doing is running up and shooting those two guys individually, and then running up, jumping, shooting. And if you get if you place yourself perfectly on that platform, then you'll shoot the bullet that that uh, gun shoots, and you won't risk getting hit by it. Um, use the B bomb to shoot that guy. I it is possible to avoid his shot, but it is incredibly difficult. Um, because of just where he's placed, basically. Um, here, just be patient and wait for that guy. Um, you have to know the pattern to be able to do that, obviously. But, uh, obviously if you're going for a Mr. Perfect run, then you know the pattern of those already, so it shouldn't be difficult for you at all. I grabbed the extra life, I won't need it because I'm playing the game without getting hit, so why would I need an extra life? Uh, again here, you're going to need to know the pattern to do this. It's pretty obvious though. If you've played, if you're going for Mr. Perfect Run, you will have had to have done it before. Uh, I recommend using the B bomb to kill these guys that are on these platforms because they can get incredibly irritating when they're moving and you're trying to wait for the green platforms to appear. Um, so just kill them and they won't get in your way. Uh, again, with that guy, just kill him with the B bomb. Uh, you could kill him with the dual satellite if you wanted to, I suppose that would be another option to do it. But I wouldn't really recommend using the dual satellite too much in this level because um, it is actually what is super effective against the. Uh, robot master of this level, which is Plugman, of course. Um, for these guys, which are like Mega Mega Mans, <laughs> if you want to call them that, um, you, I, what I do is I, as I am just about to run past it, I use a B bomb, and then it just kills them as they appear, and um, that way you're not going to risk getting hit by them because they're just going to pretty much die as soon as they are alive. <laughs> um, here again, I recommend using the dual satellite. Um, I think what I do here, unless I do it in a later room, um, do I do it here? Maybe... No, I don't. Okay, I do it in a, la a later room. Oh, I think it's actually this room here. I um, do a bit of item scavenging from these guys, which I definitely recommend doing here because you're right near the, the uh, Robot Master now. Um, is to max out your dual satellite. Your dual satellite's weapon power, because you'll need all, you'll need its weapon energy to be at maximum to have the um, right amount of shots to be able to kill Plugman. Uh, I nearly I nearly missed that. I nearly messed it up. Um, but yeah, you just be patient with that and you'll be able to jump over it easily. Uh, with this, just be patient. Stand to the left and let all those three things pass you. Unless you want to use the B-bomb, in which case that can take them out pretty easily as well. Uh, with this guy, you don't have to kill him. You can just let him jump over you and then run forwards. It doesn't really matter. Uh, of course, natural style, mega dance. You got a little mega dance from me because I was so happy that I finally beat this level. Uh, this level took quite a few attempts, I'd say about... 10 through 15 attempts of doing it, maybe. Um, Plugman himself, he is quite difficult to do without getting hit, but as, as long as you have a full weapon energy on your dual satellite, all it is really is um, avoiding him himself, because the dual satellite will um, deflect all of the plug balls that he's shooting at you, so you don't have to worry about them. As long as you have a, a satellite guard up, or whatever it's called, then you won't get hit by those. Uh, but there it is, Plugman stage done without one hit. Very happy that I've done that. So next time, we will be going over to Tornado Man stage, and I'll be beating that level. See you guys then. Bye-bye.